A local dog rescue group that shelters dozens of dogs saved from the euthanasia list will soon have to find a new home. 13 News reporter Alex Valdez joins us live from Landabone. And Alex, what is going on here? Well, Mary, last week the owners here at Lendabone got word from their landlord that he would be selling the property and they would need to leave from the building. Now the organizers only have a short time to come up with solutions and part of those solutions includes ventilated sheds. But first they will need the community's help. Since 2019, Lendabone has been rescuing dogs facing a deadline and giving them new hope. They are now looking for help keeping their mission alive. I mean, most of the dogs we rescue would otherwise not be here with us. We pull a lot from the euthanasia list and dogs that are either behavioral or medical or things like that. So a lot of it is watching a dog going from what would have been dead, you know, in the next hour to now is alive and living well in a great home, you know, with a happy family. The goal now is to move the dogs from their current location to Anaya and Rogerio's property, where they'll be able to keep caring for dogs like Roscoe. We're looking to hopefully, <laughs> hopefully get um, a new, some sheds put at our property. We currently bought one already. The owners are hoping the sheds on their property can serve as a permanent spot for the rescue. They plan on getting electricity and AC in the sheds as well. Um, so sheds are something that we think would be easy to utilize a lot of space and be able to build out to where there can be multiple kennels and yard access and it gives the dogs kind of free roam of that back and forth. Now, if you would like to make a donation, you could go ahead and head to Lendabone's website. They are also accepting any donations of sheds or help getting those sheds ready for the rescue. Reporting live from Tucson, Alex Valdez, 13 News.